Hi, I'm Kath McGaw and I'm a pediatric dietitian. I'm passionate about the little people in your life and helping them to grow into the best human beings they can be. When you have a child that comes with a lot of anxiety and are you going to get this right or are you going to get that right? And there's nothing that qualifies us for becoming a parent. So it's just learning on the go. And there are a lot of concerns that we have, and especially when it comes to our children's nutrition. We get very concerned if they are not gaining in height, if they're not gaining in weight. And this can cause a lot of anxiety around their eating. Because if our child's not growing how we think they should be growing, we panic and we worry. Another concern that I often see parents come into my practice with is that their children get sick frequently. And this is very normal during the childhood years because their immune systems are trying to grow and develop and learn how to fight all the bugs and the viruses out there. But one sickness and the next sickness does deplete your little one of all good nutrition. And we know that in a single bout of flu, they can lose up to 25% of their body weight, especially if they've had a fever. So this is a real justified concern. And what often happens is they go from one illness onto another without having time to replenish the nutritional loss that they have had. Another concern is energy. Now you might think, my toddler looks like he lives on air and he's got so much energy, but he hardly eats. And this can also be something that is masked by a toddler or a young child because they are keen to get going and on the go, but actually they have an underlying energy depletion. And so we want to correct this. A further concern is that they just have a low suppressed appetite. And that can be a big concern for us because it looks like they're not really keen on food. They look apathetic around food. So they eat less and the less they eat, the less they want to eat. And they get into this vicious cycle. So these concerns are very legitimate and they can cause a lot of anxiety in the parenting journey. So what if I told you that there is a solution? There's a supplement called Pediasure that will allow you to have a bit of a feed-in holiday. You can give it to your child knowing that it can meet all these concerns and you can relax a bit around the battles around food, around them not wanting to eat. There's a huge amount of benefits to a supplement like Pediasure, and we call it the five-in-one benefit. The first benefit is it will help them grow. So giving your child a supplement will ensure that they get sufficient calories, protein, and good fats to help them to grow both in weight and in height. The second benefit is that it will give them all the energy they need to accomplish all the activities they have to do in their busy days, whether it's going to school, whether it's going to a ballet recital, their karate lessons, whatever it is they need to accomplish that day, you know that they will get sufficient energy to meet these needs. And the third one is going to help the immune system to glow. Another wonderful benefit is that the supplement contains all the necessary nutrients for brain and cognitive development which is very reassuring for us as parents. You know that the brain is made up of 60% fat and 40% protein. And so in order to feed the brain adequately, we need to ensure that these nutrients are sufficient in their diet. And given a supplement like this can just give you peace of mind because it's perfectly balanced to ensure for optimal brain development. And then lastly, the appetite is boosted when given enough nutrition. And so you can break that terrible cycle of less food, lower appetite, therefore less food. And the way to break that cycle is to start giving good nutrition in a way that's easy, enjoyable, and accessible to your child. And by ensuring that they become more nourished, they will want to eat. And then you will find your job so much easier when feeding your child. Thank you.